a crown quick draw soul and woodland charm guys hmm star guardian crown shojin static shiv plus hurricane that doesn't sound too good i'm gonna reroll this guys Riftwalker Crown. Oh, frick for free. Oh, hell yeah, brother, man. A Brawler Zack. Mayhaps, perhaps. A Brawler Zack, guys. A Brawler Zack. A Brawler Zackington. I should have popped items, so we definitely go Last Whisper, huh? We definitely go Last Whisper, we play Jin Carry. Do I still win? Just because I have Brawler Zack early? Nice. <laughs> Let's go, guys. Let's go. A Brawler Zackington for free. Right, I mean, I level up here, right? I level up here, I play this girl. Why is he so buggy? <laughs> uh, I go Last Whisper, I go Sword. I probably don't go other items if I can avoid it. I could go Giant Slayer, but it's not really that good. I should be fine, I should be strong enough to win here. I'm not gonna go Sh Chalice. I'm probably just gonna go Tear on her. Let's just wait. I should be strong enough to win early game, right? I have a Brawler Zack, guys. Again, guys, for the people who don't know how the Riftwalker trait works, if you have three Riftwalkers, which usually you need uh, the, the, the guy, you need the Jin, which is very hard to get because it's a four cost, right? So you get it only late game. So Zack is really strong, obviously. So uh, having him early game is very strong. And then he takes the he takes the um, the closest Riftwalker that stands next to him. It gives him the trait. So now he's a hacker. Now he's a mascot. But Brawler is insane, I think. 1.75k health. 2.1k health. Yeah, 400 health diff. That sounds pretty freaking insane. So I think that's a right. That's a very cool thing. I could have leveled here. Maybe I should have. Nah, I'm chilling. Nice. Lucky. Uh, this guy's going frozen. Uh, what's it called? Living Forge. He's gonna get a lot of items over the course of the game, but right now he's pretty weak because he only has one uh, one item. One Orn item. So late game, this scales well into late game, but early game, this augment is not that strong. Oh, frick, I'm gonna die. Nah. Kale, Kale does this. Kale smurfs this, bro. Hell yeah, brother, man. Pre-level here. For sure. The duplication device is very good. We can two-star this guy. I think I will do that. Can I get the right item here, please? Sword is gone. Frick. But I'm gonna Archangel, honestly. Mm, I mean, don't mind if I do. I'll play the TF. Should probably go Protector's Vow, no? Protector's Vow is good here. Should have duplicated Pike. Ah, I hope I don't lose because of that. And I should be strong. Oh no, I made a giant slayer. Oh rip. I mean it's okay. It's not okay. Uh, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay. It's okay, guys. The reason why I should have duplicated the pike is because it gives Zack more uh, health. Oh nice. Look, see now he's two star and he has 400 more health. 
the more star levels you have on your uh, juicers, the more uh, juicers he gets. Yeah, the more uh, juice he gets. Okay, I'm pretty sure I got so lucky now with the two star. Like I, I'm gonna keep my missile 100 for sure now. He has prep though. He has a really strong setup. Everything two star as well. I think I should be fine, bro. I think I really will be fine. Let's go, frick it. Freaky guys. Brawler Zach, 2.5k health. Okay, this guy's dead. Let's go. Uh, Giant Slayer. Uh, I'm a little bit sad, guys. Because, like, I probably have to pop it eventually anyway. But the thing is, Giant Slayer... You don't really want Giant Slayer on this Jin. You want Death Blade. So if I drop another sword here, I'll be a little bit sad. But if I drop another sword, I'll just go with Death Blade anyway. It's fine. And then I get Jeweled Lotus and I'm chilling. Not bad. Of course, Giant Slayer is fine, but you remember how Jin works, guys. He shoots the lowest health enemy with his fourth shot. The Giant Slayer usually isn't going to do that much, but it's not the worst. Like, it's really not that bad. But Jin is like... Jin is a decent champion now, but he's not as good as some other champions. So he is really reliant on having his best build, and then he's very good. So uh, Death Blade, Last Whisper. I mean, he got buffed, so I'm sure it's fine now. After the buff, it should be okay. This could gonna be redemption or something. It's just gonna be redemption, I think. I could also go mascot emblem. If I somehow get that. I should be able to greed, right? I don't think I have to level. There's no way I have to level here, right? He's level 5, is he gonna level? He can level for Sivir, he's probably gonna level for Sivir, but I should be okay, with all my 2 stars. Okay, nice, I'm against someone else. Level 5 as well, base, did he level? Just to know his psychology. No, he didn't level, okay. Just to know how aggressive the player plays, right? Alright, uh, Akibab, thank you for the Prime, welcome to Shuriken, thank you for your support, man. Much appreciated, sir. Thank you, thank you. I should probably sell these. I'm not gonna go for three star pike. Let's be real, guys. Like, I'm just gonna level. Phony frontline. Luden's echo. Knife's edge. That's just phony frontline, then. That's okay. I have a trillion, bazillion frontline now. Uh, I mean, I'm gonna level here for sure. I'm just gonna play something random. I am not sure what. What's the most useful unit I can play here? Probably her, no? But I don't need more frontline. I'll play this. Need more damage. <sighs> also, he gets bugged sometimes. So I'm just gonna move him. As you can see, whenever I move this, he's, he, he blinks. So I'm gonna make sure I move him. Remember one game I lost because of it. I just had five mascots suddenly. It's weird. When you move him last second or something, I, I'm not gonna risk it. He's level 6 as well now. We have phony frontline. Like, we have so much frontline. He just doesn't get through it, I think. Oh, he does get through it, though. Oh, this is not good. When the Blitzcrank dies... Oh, no, I'm sure. Luckily, I found that Tips of Fate. The Tips of Fate adds a lot of damage. I right, missed 100, level 6, 50. This is 100, level 650. Um, 36 to level. Level 6. Level 6, blue buff Axiomark, 3 star, uh, 2 star everything though. This guy, last stand, level 5. This guy, level 6, Ezreal Star Guardian. I'm just gonna do it, frick it. Let's go. Mascot is big. Poor guy, man. Fights me when when he I'm level 5. Uh, when I'm level 6, he, uh, 7, he's level 5. I leveled for the other guys. I just want to make sure I win. I wasn't sure if I would win. Yeah. 
And uh, with this, you can basically make... Um, turn your Zac into any trait, but not really. It always takes the lowest trait on the list. So you can never make him into admin. You can make him into brawler, but not into admin. Because admin is always listed first. It's uh, the difference between classes and whatever else. Origins and classes. They, they have different names for these things. Like admin is an origin or something. And brawler is a class. Something like that. But uh, it doesn't really matter. Just know that always the lowest listed trait gets yoinked. From the champion that has the Riftwalker. Gonna go Redemption here. I said I didn't know that, yeah. That means gain 60% attack damage. Nah, this is not worth playing. It's not worth playing, guys. I don't think I play admin here. Having the Viego is good. Having the Viego is good. I will want to play Renegade with Jin. My freaking, uh, my freaking Kale is trash, bro. Like we need something else. <coughs> Woo! Woo! Bless you, man. Thank you. Oh yeah. Yeah, uh, he, he's already surrendering, I think. No offense to him. Do you see what he has? Did you see what this mother trucker has? Uh, can I play something better? I mean, this is better for sure. Did you see what that mother trucker has, bro? He's so mad. He gets Infinity Team Crown, takes Ancient Archives, and he got a Star Guardian Emblem. Oh, hell no, nah, man. What is that? That is so unlucky. He's turbo mad. For sure. Okay, I don't know if I can kill this. This is actually so intimidating. Is he wind streaking? Yeah, this is disgusting actually. Nah, this is just silly that I just lose my wind streak to that. My nine wind streak? Just because he has Death's Defiance Nar too? That's a little bit silly, guys. That is a tiny bit silly. Okay, but now I'm pretty sure we just lost streak or we just we just chill, like we're still stable. We just chill at this until um level nine. Uh level eight. And then I roll 50 gold, level 8. Try to find Jin 2. Jin 2, Viego 2. Uh, maybe a Leona if we get lucky. I can go Riftwalker, Jin. Then I can turn the, the guy into a heart. That sounds really bad. He has 100 mana. Uh, heart seems really bad. I was hoping I can turn him into Ox Force. I was hoping I can turn him into Ox Force. I lose duelists though for this. It's kind of cringe, no? But it's so much better than this thing. I think it's so much better though. It's worth. And then this can just be hero augment. I mean, we have Riftwalker active. We just want the Jin augment. We do not want Ace active. Oh, this is good. Just mech items. Okay, we're preparing for Jin uh, mech team. With Leona Mech, the Reddit comp, guys. Very simple. The Reddit comp. As you guys know it and love it. Or at least I love it. I think it's really good and Jin got buffed, so it's turbo good. Yeah, starting the game with a Zack makes everything much easier, huh? <laughs> I don't think we can kill this thing. We did just kill it, in fact. I don't think we can kill this backline. Oh, that's okay. That's a one-unit loss. I'll take it, man. I will take it, mister. 
the behemoth. Uh, we want the gin, right? We want the gin. When you field him, your units that star combat in the back two rows deal 16% bonus damage. Don't I want the gold one though? I have two more refreshes. There's no way I don't hit it. But I could hit Viego. Don't roll, you can get Viego. Yeah, it's too risky to get Viego. Okay. I think this is honestly fine. Now I just make my units start in the back. Like, except for the tanks. Yeah, it's fine. Like, it is good. It's, it's probably better, bro. Like, it's better in terms of onboard strength. But it's not better in terms of fun. Because if we can print money, it's always the most fun, right? Printing money is super fun. It's just not worth, man. I raced it earlier and got stuck with Viego support. Yeah, Viego support wouldn't be good. We don't really need life steal that much like I'll definitely rather take this because as you can see I can probably go fast nine and um, or not turbo fast nine but I can roll a little bit at eight and then I can save a lot of gold and go level nine as well and then uh, level nine I can just uh, play Urgot fiddle in the back and they will just deal 16% increased damage which is insane and these guys can stand in the back so it's not even bad and our admin was trash well not that good so yeah we're chilling, and we have best in slot Leona. Not best in slot. Best in slot Leona is Dragon Claw. In my opinion, best in slot Leona is Dragon Claw. Protector's Vow, so she casts instantly. And then Bloodthirster, guys. Bloodthirster, three Renegade, Bloodthirster, you're chilling. I'll keep him, uh, I'll keep him Brawler. He's still a Brawler. Because as you can see, he has a lot of health. If you put in the fourth Riftwalker, it doesn't do anything, but it does. What it does is uh, it gives this guy, the way this guy works, he scales up his health the more combined star levels you have on your Riftwalkers. So as you saw, he turned into a 2-star as soon as I got 2-star Pike. Because 2-star Pike is now 2-star levels, plus 1-star Vex, plus 2-star Blitzcrank. That gives him enough uh, to get, get into a certain health threshold where, I mean, the two, him showing as a 2-star is just vanity, it's just... Just to make, just to show you, oh, you leveled him up. But he levels up with each individual. So putting in the one-star Jin it gives him probably like 200 health with the Brawler trait, yeah. So, but of course, I will take out this Garbage Pike. Let's see what I get here. Doesn't really matter, honestly. I mean, I want Deathblade. I want Deathblade or Infinity Edge, but it doesn't really matter because at the end of the day, uh, I already got insane items and I can always find a Legendary that I just want to equip. I mean, I'm not even going to roll then. Like what? I I'm just going to level up and sit, no? Like what? Eh? If I just hit, I'm just going to level up and sit. The admin is trash. I could go Renegade, though. Isn't Renegade worth now? Oh, frick. This is turbo good. <laughs> like, what? <laughs> okay, I mean, everything is perfect then. Okay, GG, yeah. Bye-bye. Static Shiv Morgana. <laughs> Cost and lose? Exactly, man. Cost and lose, sir. Four. Three? The admin is trash. I'm not going to play admin long term. I'm going to probably still play 5 Renegade. Just because I have Viego. But I can also just ditch Viego and play more legendaries. That benefit from this uh, Jin Augment. Nice. Nice mech. I kind of need Wukong. Huh? I forgot I need to hold Wukong. Because Wukong would be nice for mech. Uh, so we could get Defender for free. Yeah, we could go 5 Renegade. The thing is, if we want to go 5 Renegade, we need to keep this idiot. I don't want to keep this idiot. I think I can just go 3 Renegade, ditch this guy, make this guy... Uh, Leona is going to be our Renegade, our second Renegade. Jin, Leona, and Zack are going to be our 3 Renegade. But I could also just go... Um, 
What if I go Ace Zack? No. What can I do, man? What what is the what is the coolest Zack? What is the coolest Zack? What's something that is shown at the bottom? Oh, can I go corrupted Zack? Wait, I can go corrupted Zack, right? Does he have a good AP ratio? Are we winning, Mr. Shirky? We got a third place, and this looks like a first place so far. So we are definitely doing well, Tooper. What's up? Zack Forecaster. Look, it is listed at the on. No, look, see these mother truckers? They put Threat at the bottom, and Threat doesn't do anything. Corrupted is at the top, so you can't go corrupted, Zack. Lame. Lame-o, right? Lame. Piece of garbage company. That's okay. Unlucky. Uh, what is... Uh, what is Nunu? Nunu is mascot Gadgetine, so Gadgetine is at the top, huh? Listed at the top. I could also just play the... Mm, I think I just go for mascot. Yeah, I know what I'll do. I'll go for a Nunu as well. Two-star Nunu. It's gonna be good. We get death played. GG. Sunfire Nunu. Sunfire Nunu, right? Oh no, Sunfire. Mm, Protector's Vow Nunu. Edge of Night Nunu. Edge of Night Nunu is not that bad. I'll go Edge of Night Nunu. Not that bad. I mean, I'm not leveling yet. I can still sack more. Should play this. I can still sack more. I need a new Alistair. Edge of Night on who right now? On Pike? Sure. Pike is gonna get bitch. Okay, so our final team will be Jin, Leona, Garen, Wukong, uh, Bex, Viego, Alistair, Nunu. That's eight. We will have Riftwalker, we will have Renegade, and then just a Fiddle or an Urgot, two-star, for the ninth spot. Th this will give us four, um, this will give us three Renegade, and four Mascot. And the Zack will be Mascot. It will give us four Mascot with the Nunu. The Nunu will deal a ton of damage in the back, because we can start him in the back line, and he still runs forward, so that's really cool. And then, uh, yeah, that's gonna be our team. That's gonna be our team. Backseat's crazy today. Yeah, I just ignore them, man. Turbo cringe. Dude, he should look in chat more. Uh, there's literally a rule you shouldn't backseat. And you're telling me to look in chat more so I can see more of your backseating, little guy. What is wrong with you, man? I am not gonna freaking duplicate the Vex. I, I just said I need a Vukong. I will duplicate Vukong, man. There's plenty of other uses. There's Alistair and Wukong that I can duplicate. So I will not just duplicate the Vex immediately right now. Because I have 75 health. I couldn't care less if I lose here. He should look in chat more. Come on, little guy. Calm your booty. Again, guys, I get really mad at the backseaters. Because this would be a YouTube video if you're watching this as a YouTube video. And you're like, it's so unreasonable. It might sound unreasonable for you. But uh, you don't stream. You don't sit here and see these backseaters 50 million times every day. Even though there is literally a rule. You click on the chat box, it pops up. Do not backseat. Do not backseat. That's the only rule. Do not backseat and English only. Two rules. And you have to click OK, accept the rule, and then you can type. So the person did that, and then they still backseated. And that is disrespectful. Because that is just... Oh, so this guy doesn't want me to do something... I'm gonna do it anyway. That is just, I mean, come on now. If you don't get even a little bit mad at that, then you are a monk. And you have my respect. I am not as powerful as you guys. I will get mad. You guys are too powerful mentally. You are a monk. Respectable. You meditate every day two hours. I cannot even re meditate ten minutes a day. I get too bored. So you are respectable, guys. Good job, guys. You are monks. I wanted the thieves, love. That's okay. You are monks, guys. Monk Andy. I'll just go this. 
I don't need heart emblem. I don't need heart emblem, man. I don't think it's worth pivoting yet. I think this is fine right now. I lose Brawler Zack. It's not worth pivoting yet. It's not worth pivoting yet, right? Go Shroud. Go Hodge. Probably just Giant Slam. It's not worth pivoting yet. It really isn't. I'm gonna, I'm gonna pivot here. I have 60 health, guys. I can easily lose two rounds. Because if I hit everything two-star, I win the game, guys. I could have taken the Defender Emblem, so I don't need a Wukong. But even if I don't have Defender, it's okay. It would be nice to have it, though, for sure. It's not worth the pivot yet. Um, okay. And remember, guys, this is just a 1, 2, or 3 cost uh, duplicator, so we cannot go for 3 star Jin or something like that. Not gonna, I mean, we can still go for it if we get lucky, but you know. Alright, we'll drop to like 28 here or something. He has a 2 star Leona as well, that's a big issue. Yeah, I definitely need all the money I can get here for the pivot. I need to hit 2 star Leona. Leona 1 will not cut it. Need the two star. Hopefully, we can kill a lot of units here. I'd be very happy if we just kill a lot of units. Nice. We're killing a decent amount here. The Death Blade really makes a huge difference, guys. Death Blade is so good. Look at this. Wow, we win? Oh, hell no, man. I'm so strong. I think I'll win because the Fiddle has 16% bonus damage. <laughs> Let's go, guys. He has Ace at the bottom. I could go Ace. Um, I could go Ace guy. That would be fun. I could go ace on the dude. On the Zack. I mean, I'll, I'll just level here, bro. I want to. Maybe I'll get a Bloodthirster out of this, which would be better. Ooh, Booba! A Booba, guys! Booba! Hooba Booba, guys! Hooba Booba! Okay, why the frick am I not rolling right now? I'm dizzy, I'm dizzy, guys. I'm dizzy. Alarm. I am dizzy. I am dizzy, guys. I am the Dizzler. I'm turbo dizzy. Alarm. I'm very dizzy. I'm dizzy. Watch out, guys. I'm about to diz all over you. Diz, not j. What? What? I mean, I can do the other thing if you want. What? Come on out, guys. Just chill out, guys. I mean, there's a Wukong. Uh, there's this guy. I didn't find a single... I didn't find a single Nunu. Isn't that crazy? Is that not crazy, guys? How did I not find a single Nunu? 
No one even bought a single Nunu. See, that's what I, that's what I mean, guys. You go level 9, and you still don't hit. Oh, she needs to ult here. She needs to ult. She needs to ult. Oh, she's killing him. Nice. Okay, good job. Still lose. Do we have a 2-star uh, Alistair? We don't. Now we do. How did I not find a Nunu? Huh? Well, that cannot be good. Is it in the last two lines? In the back two rows, okay. So we don't have to go in the full back. This is the Leona battle. But his Leona died. <laughs> I need a Jin, I win the game. I need Nunu 2 star instead of uh, Fiddlesticks. I need Urgot 2 star as well. Urgot is doing so much damage as just 1 star. Did I put Edge of Night on Urgot? I did, right? Some people are really strong. Power Grid, Mana Zane. Both hard setups huh, against each other. Yeah, I'm definitely getting top 2, that's good. I don't need Ox Force Emblem. Wait, people are spamming there's a Jin. Did someone take the Jin? That's sad, bro. Uh, QSS, doesn't really matter what I get here. Hold up. Who took the Jin? Did he is he keeping it? Is he keeping it on the bench? Or did he sell it? Okay, nice. That's good. There's a Nunu as well. Ah, oh, there's a Nunu as well! I'm just gonna keep it this way, I don't wanna mess up the positioning anything. <laughs> I'm, so, I'm so dizzy, guys. I'm so dizzy, I have too many items. I'm just gonna give this to her. I'm so dizzy. I went level 9 and I he ratted. Yeah, but he wanted the Zephyr, guys. He needs to rat. And he needs the Zephyr, it's not disgusting. It's a PvP game, guys. Like, seriously, he needs to do that. He's stupid if he doesn't. Look how good the Bloodthirster is. Imagine Redemption instead. Bloodthirster is so much better, right? But the Redemption should not be on, on, on the Fiddle. The Redemption should be on somebody else, not on Fiddle, guys. Yeah, the Redemption should not be on Fiddle. That's really a failure. It should be on him, so he walks up next to her and then gives her the Redemption buff. You know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna just frontline the fiddle. I, I can't greet the damage on fiddle, I think. I cannot greet the damage on fiddle, I think. Okay, I dodge Zephyr based. Okay, nice. I'm gonna laser the Nar soon. Nice, okay, we win this fight, which means we're top two, because one of them has to die, the Zona player won. Nunu instead of Fiddle, guys, two star Nunu instead of Fiddle, no, isn't that better? For sure is better, although, hmm, against the hard setup, I probably just want to stun them. It's four hard, but it's honestly not just the hard setup, it's a freaking Gnar setup, this guy is really capped out. This guy is so powerful. I really want to get that Nunu, man. <sighs> Nunu. Let's see what we get here. Is that just Ionic Spar?
We don't have that much magic damage though, honestly. Nah. It's something on Fiddle. It could be BT or Warmox. I think Warmox is the best bang for the buck. Oh, Nunu too. Let's see if this is better. For Mascot, it also helps the Leona a lot. Guys, remember? The healing helps the Leona a lot. And Warmogs with Mascot is really good. No, 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 no. Why is she ulting the Echo? Oh, she died. Okay. Not much you can do. We didn't hit uh, Jin. Didn't hit Jin, yeah. I got dizzy at the end, but like the issue was, um, I'm pretty sure Nunu is better. I won against his ghost, which ghosts always have bugs, right? This guy is really strong. Also, my uh, he he put the the echo, which taunted my Leona right before she was attacking the Nar. She was about to ult him, but it taunted her right before, and then I ult in the opposite direction onto Echo, and then he just wins. Yeah. Sad game, guys. Like, Jin 2, Jin 3 should have happened. Jin 3 should have happened. I should have just sold it, man. I got too dizzy because of it. I was like, oh man, I need to watch out for Jin on carousel and stuff. But it's okay, we'll take our top two, guys. The enemy comp was turbo maxed out. Look at this, man. It's the any three star as well. I probably lost because of that. Although I did laser it, right? We'll take it, guys. Subscribe to the notification bell if you enjoy these TFT videos. Also, make sure to leave an algorithmic comment and an algorithmic like down below. Do support this video in the YouTube algorithm so I can get some more views and I'll see you next time. Peace.